Hello, this is going to be a quick preview of the new features of the video player plugin. You now see the CryEngine video playing. <coughs> the scale phone video. You can also skip by using the space key. Uh, you can now see a background video playing on the menu. Let's load up a test map. You can now see a start movie. Now you can see two videos playing. This one is uh, in VGA resolution and this one is in full HD resolution. Okay, uh, the recording might be a bit skippy, but uh, if you try it out yourself, you will see that it works pretty fluid. Okay, this was the DirectX 9 mode. Let's try out the DirectX 11 mode. Simply save this. Okay, let's try out the 64 bit build too. And you see it's working now in DirectX 11 mode. Let's load up the map. That movie and again you can see the other movies playing okay also I included uh, a background video for the in-game pause menu you can see here the discs rotating uh, with transparency in the background also you can say exit game and you will get back to the main menu with the full opacity uh, background video. Okay, that's it for showing the features. I found a new software for encoding the WebM videos. It's very uh, nice. Uh, it's called Xmedia uh, Recode. I included it in the description. Uh, let's show it. Um, you can uh, simply drag in your file here, select the format as WebM and uh, if you want you can uh, leave out the audio here and then simply, uh, simply press a job and then encode also if you want to uh, separate the audio from the video stream using mkv merge GUI I forgot uh, to say you have to set this uh, setting while muxing. Um, it, it will create then web in conformant files. If you don't set this, uh, it might not work. Okay, that's it. And yeah, have fun trying out the new features. Oh, yeah, I could show you uh, quickly the playlist format. It's also explained in the README. Let's have a quick look. Uh, in the video folder you can see now these three files. Uh, those will be automatically played. Let's have a quick look into one. It's a very simple format. You can specify everything you uh, need to specify the, your input file and where you want to output it and 
multiple scenes. The scenes uh, are like chapters. Uh, if you press the space uh, key and it's skippable, it will jump to the next scene. This here is the background loop movie, so it is not skippable and is a loop. It will be automatically closed if you exit the menu. And this here is, for example, the splash screen video. You can see here two scenes and they are skippable. Yes. So, and uh, level startup videos are located in the folder of the level. You simply uh, specify what you want to play if the level is loaded and uh, it's played. You can also uh, use playlists in combination with the flow notes um, but you have to try it out yourself yeah. okay that's it for today bye